hi guys welcome back to the channel today we are in the grill jamaica and we are giving you an update on the construction of the sandals Negril hotel now what we're looking at is the honeymoon suites that the hotel is building more honeymoon suites so this is the construction on the way and sandals is one of the largest hotel chains in jamaica they have hotels in almost at all the major tourist areas in jamaica and one of the sandals offers a lot of wedding packages so a lot of people come to jamaica to get married at sandals so they are actually building more hotel suites for the honeymoon because Sandals is an all-inclusive hotel, so they give you the full package. And Sandals is also building two hotels in Ocho Rios. Sandals, um, Duns River. I think they're renovating one hotel and building another one. Sandals, Duns River. They're adding a lot more rooms to the, to the hotels they have in Jamaica. And this hotel, Sandals Negril, that we're looking at is actually a couple's hotel. So children are not allowed or single persons are not allowed. It's a couple's hotel. But Sandals also operates the beaches name. Or in the, Bre the beaches hotel chain, sorry. That's, that's the best, best, the correct way to say it. And that hotel, the beaches hotels, they cater to families and children and those non-couples basically so this is actually Negril you can see in this part of the video we're actually driving into Negril from Hanover and you can see very lovely sunset or it's evening and we're going to show you the this section of Negril is full of hotels this is why Negril contributes a billion dollars a year to the tourism industry in Jamaica. Has so many hotels. It's this is Rio on the right, and Rio has two hotels in Negril. And Sandals has quite a few, including uh, Beaches Hotel. So on the well, we haven't passed it yet, but we're going to pass it soon. We'll be the Negril Aerodrome. And that hotel, that aerodrome is going to be upgraded to an international airport soon. So can you imagine landing? Okay, this is the airport now on the left. It's actually the runway. And you're, this that's the Sandals, or one of the Sandals hotels on the right. And this is the entrance to the aerodrome here where they would have the terminal on the left here. So can you imagine landing at that international airport, the Grill International Airport? And in less than a minute, you can drive to your hotel. This is Royalton Hotel on the right. And Jamaica has three major tourist areas, Montego Bay, Ocho Rios, and Negril. Negril is probably the second largest tourist area in Jamaica. So it's very important that they get that hotel built, as that, sorry, that airport built as quickly as possible. What's there now is an aerodrome, so it doesn't meet the requirements to call it an airport. And then you're going to have to have certain requirements for an international airport. So the government's plan is to upgrade the airport to the Negril International Airport and land the small planes. This is another sand. Actually, this is the sandals where they're building the, the, those, the honeymoon suites. So phase one of the project is to upgrade the airport so that it can land the small planes like the Ian Fleming International Airport and then later on upgrade it to a larger runway that can land the bigger planes. So this is actually where they're doing the construction. So we're just giving you the drive in and then the drive out to show you more of the grid. So it's very important that that hotel is, why do I keep saying hotel? That airport is upgraded as quickly as possible because 
it will definitely put Negril um, more on the map. Negril might actually become the number one tourist destination in Jamaica. Now, to, today the number one destination area is Montego Bay, and they have the Sangster International Airport there. So if you're going to go to stay in Negril, you still have to land at the Sangster International Airport and drive to Negril, and it takes about an hour. So if they had an airport in the grill, it takes you one minute from the airport to your hotel room, to your hotel, game changer. So it's very important that that airport be built. And Sandals is growing. So they're expanding their hotels, putting in a lot more rooms. And in some cases, just building a new hotel. Sandals is Jamaica's premier hotel brand, without a doubt. And it's locally owned by Jamaicans. The largest foreign hotel brand in Jamaica is Rio. And as you can see, Negril has two Rio hotels. Antigua Bay has three. Ocho Rios has one. And they're building a seventh one in, in Trelawney. And we actually have videos up of the construction, so you can check it out. And remember, we make update videos on all the major construction sites in Jamaica every two weeks. And the non-major ones are the smaller ones. We do them every month. So remember to like, share and subscribe so that you don't miss any videos. Okay, this now we're continuing into the town itself of Negril and you're going to see even more hotels. The larger hotels are more closer to the aerodrome, closer to the sandals. Closer to this area, as we get closer to the town, you're going to see a lot of the smaller hotels. And then you have the West End, which has a lot of hotels, too, but they aren't as large as the ones that we just passed. So on the left now is the water park. I think it's Cool Runnings Water Park is the official name. Very popular water park in Negril. All right, guys, well, enjoy the rest of the video as we drive through Negril. And remember to like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day.